Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to the Listing Real Estate Show where we talk all things real estate. I'm Tatum and today we are going to be talking a little bit about closing costs when purchasing a home. Now I get asked all the time by my clients, how much are closing costs going to be? What's associated with the closing costs? So I'm sure a lot of you out there probably have the same questions. So let's get into it and let's have some fun. I want to start out by saying when you're financing, closing costs are going to be typically right around 3% of the purchase price. So let's say for simplicity's sake, you're purchasing a $1 million house. Boom. Closing costs are going to be right around $30,000. That is 3% of $1 million. Now, if you are paying cash, it's going to be a little bit less because you don't have to pay for the fees associated with your lender. So that brings me to, well, what's included in closing costs? Well, there's a couple of things. You're gonna have the prorated property taxes, homeowner's insurance, the fees associated with your lender if you are financing, and then the transfer of title fees. All these things are grouped up into the closing costs. So what I recommend is that when you find a house that you absolutely love, and you're like, oh, I'm a little bit nervous, do I have the funds for closing? Well, give your lender a call and ask for a GFE, or which is known as a good faith estimate. He'll run some numbers for you based on the, the price of the house that you're purchasing and he'll put it all together and this is going to be a much more accurate number of exactly how much you're going to have to bring to closing. So guys, I hope this was helpful. If you have any other questions regarding buying or selling, I'd love to help out in any way that I can. I hope you guys have a great week and cheers to the weekend. Have a good day. I'll see you next week.